This free step-by-step -step video comes to you directly from Haynes. You can complete more than 200 jobs on this vehicle when you purchase the complete Haynes online manual at haynes.com. Auxiliary drive belt renewal. First, remove the wheel bolt covers, then, using the locking wheel bolt adapter where necessary, slacken the wheel bolts. Position the jack under the front subframe rear mounting and raise the vehicle. Now place axle stands in position, then lower the vehicle onto the axle stands and remove the jack. The wheel bolts can now be removed and the wheels lifted from the vehicle. Remove the screws from the underside of the lower wing liner, then remove the screws from the upper edge of the lower wing liner. Now remove the lower section of the wing liner from the vehicle. Fit a spanner to the tensioner then rotate it anti-clockwise and fit the locking pin, shown here on the bench for clarity. The belt can now be lifted off and removed from the vehicle. With the belt removed, check all pulleys are free from any damage and are secure. Also, check that the alternator and air conditioning compressor are mounted securely. Fit the new auxiliary belt ensuring that it sits correctly on all the pulleys. Fit a spanner to the tensioner, then remove the locking pin as you slowly release the spanner, allowing the tensioner to tighten the belt. Refit the lower section of the wing liner, replacing all screws that secure the upper edge and the underside of the liner. Lift the wheels onto the hub, then refit and loosely tighten the wheel bolts. Position the jack, raise the vehicle, and remove the axle stands. Lower the vehicle to the ground and remove the jack. Tighten the wheel bolts, then remove the locking bolt adapter. Refit the wheel bolt covers.